In my opinion, Gwen is the perfect person to receive a star on the Walk of Fame. Gwen Stefani gets a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame, and her husband Blake Shelton's speech during the ceremony is lovely. It all happens on Hollywood Boulevard October 19th, and while the singer and voice coach receives the huge honors surrounded by her colleagues and loved ones, it's her country star husband who does speak and nearly steals the spotlight from his beautiful bride. The first time that I ever met Gwen was in 2014. She wasn't like any other famous person that I had ever met before. She drove herself to work in a black minivan with car seats in it. <laughs> she didn't roll in with security. She came in with a baby and two little boys, which at the time worked like security because nobody was going near. Uh, it, was, it was chaos. Uh, it was clear to me that she was a mother first and foremost over anything else in the war world. That was her number one job. And now standing here almost 10 years later, after I first met her, I can say without question that being a mother is still the most important thing in her life. And I gotta tell y'all, that that's rare uh, in this business. Uh, but today, it's nice to see her honored uh, for her side project, which is being one of the biggest stars in the world. In my opinion, Gwen is the perfect person to receive a star on the Walk of Fame. From music, television, and movies, to fashion and beauty, she has risen to the top over and over again with her unique style that has made the world fall in love with her. Not as much as me, though. And then there's that one thing that no one can ever explain. It's that thing that she was just born with that will make you stop and go, wait, who is that? What's her name? What does she do? Why do I love her already? What the hell? That's the thing that God gives you. And without question, God gave Gwen an extra scoop of it. What makes me the happiest for Gwen, though, is that this all started with a song that she wrote. Songwriting is her favorite thing to do, and she happen happens to be exceptionally talented at it. it. Yes. If you take a look at Gwen's discography over the years, from the early days of No Doubt to her solo records, there's one common denominator on 99% of the songs. Gwen Stefani, the songwriter. Gwen has blessed a lot of people's lives with her songwriting talent in more ways than one. Now I know firsthand that it takes a lot of people to make a hit record, but none of this would have ever happened without Gwen Stefani, the songwriter. So congratulations to my all-time favorite songwriter on your star. You deserve this, and I love you. If I didn't have the voice and I didn't have Irving, I wouldn't have met my best friend, my husband, Blake Shelton. I love you so much. You have given me the kind of love I never knew before. The minute I met you, I knew I was home and I'm so, so proud that you're mine. I can't believe it. I love you so much. Growing up in Anaheim, California, I had such, thank you. <laughs> I had such amazing family, Jill, Eric, Todd, and my incredible parents, Patty and Dennis. They taught us how to be creative and love music, love God. And, but it was my brother, Eric Stefani, who's here today that taught me. He taught me how to write songs. He taught me how to be original. And it's because of you, we had no doubt, and I will always look up to you. And of course, um, the greatest gift of all is to be a mom to Kingston, Zuma, and Apollo. You are my biggest blessings. I can't believe 
that I get to be your mom. I'm so proud of you guys. I, I, it is literally my biggest joy of my life. Being able to write music, um, I never saw that coming. The first song I wrote, it, you know, it gave me my life purpose. So thank you, God, for that. And thank you to all of the fans, you guys. Honestly, every single person that listened to my music all these years, I would not be here without you guys. It has been a beautiful exchange of love. Thank you so much, Hollywood! That was hella good, no doubt. Previously in May, Gwen gave an equally awesome speech at Blake's Walk of Fame ceremony. It blows my mind to be here today standing on the Hollywood Walk of Fame, celebrating my husband, by the way, Blake Shelton. You are so deserving of this honor, and the boys and I, and um, all of your family, your friends, your colleagues, could not be more proud. Okay, let me try to paint the picture of the little boy, Blake Shelton, who had a simple kind of life and a big dream. Growing up in a tiny, 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 tiny town in Oklahoma, the backdrop of his life was nature. He was in the woods all day long, not wanting to come home until it was dark, knowing every name of every tree, every species of animal, with a soul connection to country music and what country music represents. Right there. <laughs> There is no one more authentic than this guy. He lives and he breathes country music. He is a country music jukebox, and it is his DNA. He was born to do this and hasn't done anything because he wanted to be a star. He has just always been a star. From barely graduating from high school <laughs> to roofing houses, and then moving to Nashville by himself at 17 years old to chase the only thing he ever wanted to do in his life, be a country singer. With 28, 28 number one singles, 23 seasons on The Voice, Blake has always stayed true to himself. There is nobody like him. He is a one-of-a-kind guy, and the audiences all fall in love with him. He's humble, he's genuine, and trust me, wherever we go, Everybody feels like they know Blake Shelton. Blake, you are a rare human being, and for all the success that you have had in your life as a singer, a songwriter, a musician, a performer, an entertainer, an actor, a comedian, comedian. yeah, an entrepreneur, he's the same guy at, today as he was back then, a country guy with a love for country music. He's magnetic, the most generous person you'll ever know, and always just him, no matter where he goes, making people happy, laugh, making jokes, and well, always playing jokes. Like the reason, the reason Blake Shelton is here today on the Hollywood Walk of Fame is because you are part of the country dream, the Hollywood dream, and you are part of the American dream. And everybody knows you are my dream come true. Oh. <laughs> But now it's Gwen's time to shine, and even though she's just a girl in the world, this Orange County babe has risen to the level of truly glamorous fashion and music icon. If you're not already fangirling over her to the level that her husband is, what you waiting for? 